It's a big day for rugby here at Winchester RFC with three different cup finals taking place all on the same day, one after the other. Now, the one that we will be covering and the one that we're interested in is a bit of a derby. It's between the Peter Simmons College and the King Edward VI School. Now, there's more spice that added to this one because the Peter Simmons coach is Mike Marchant, which is our very own Winchester RFC coach. So he'll be hoping to get a win on his home ground and take back the trophy for Peter Simmons College. Jason Curtis will be seeing this one with you. The final attracted one of the largest crowds of the season with rivalries on and off the pitch. My brother's playing for King Edwards and I'd like him to lose, to be honest, because I was at Simmons. He seemed to be getting his wish as Peter Simmons created the move of the match with Miles Roberts Bailey breaking away to score after half an hour. <laughs> After the conversion, they led 7 0 at half time with their players delighted. <laughs> Tom Humberstone scored a penalty with just over 10 minutes to go, which seemed to end chances of a late comeback for King Edward. They didn't give up hope though and maintained some late pressure, but in the torrential rain, they were unable to break through. The final whistle was greeted with delight by all associated with Peter Simmons, with the Winchester College running out 10-0 winners. The players decided to celebrate in a slippery style, but luckily for them their rugby was far more clean. Captain Zach Kinnaird received the trophy for his team during the post-match ceremony. Both he and coach Mike Marchant had this to say after. Uh, yeah, definitely fantastic. I mean, Kez really came at us and we really held together as a team, so to win is fantastic considering the conditions as well. We've only lost once this season and it was like in these conditions we lost 10-0, so to win 10-0 I think is quite significant. It's great to be on a winning side. <laughs> uh, no, it, it's good. I mean, it, it's good for Hampshire Schools rugby and it's, it's really good for Winchester. You know, you look at the players that played, 44 players there involved today, probably 28, 30 come from Winchester, so it, it, it's really good for, for the area as well.